Okay, this is Rob. Just of course you know where you are. My name is A D S. Let's do this. I see the hot. <laughs> Wait, to it really seems some people are not feeling the heat coming from this government. You wish to ask. Do you know that some people are actually calling on President Buhari to extend his tenure on the grounds of insecurity for at least a period of six months? Who have that time? Maybe I shouldn't blame this grandpa for even suggesting it in the first place. Sir, Chief Robert Clark, Senior Advocate of Nigeria. With all due respect, sir, what are you talking about? Hear, hear what he had to say. The president can serve for more than eight years, according to the constitution. It's something I've always said is written in the law. If the current scenario remains, making it difficult to vote in 2023 election, the constitution states that the president will write to INEC. In the light of insurgencies, kidnappings, and Boko Haram, I don't believe we can have a good election in these diverse areas of Nigeria. He went further to say, according to the constitution, I will stay for six months in, in the first instance. The fact that the president cannot serve for more than eight years is therefore incorrect. Hmm. Because the same constitution says that if the conditions remain, he can give himself six months. I'm just sharing this for the first time. The option is for Mr. President to stay in office and enable the security forces to do the job. And Nigeria would be stable again. Because I swear to God Almighty, Nigeria is going nowhere without stability and security. When a foreigner realizes that any of these expatriates sent to Nigeria could be kidnapped at any time, he will not bring his money and invest in any business in Nigeria. Then he said, so I don't see any green light until all of these issues are resolved. This country will be in flames if nothing occurs before the elections. Clark predicted. <laughs> oh my God, let me ask. So the insecurity Mr. President could not solve in eight years. Hmm? Clark is not suggesting he will now solve it in six months extension of tenure. Mm -mm. That's not what we need. This is the most ridiculous thing I've heard in six months. What can the president do in six months when he already allowed insecurity to linger this long? This problem of insecurity is now deep-rooted. To approach it would take another strategy from a fresh president, not from a president that has run out of ideas and strategies already. Reacting to this unholy call for extension of tenure, Mr. President, in a statement released by his senior special assistant on media and publicity, Gabasheu, said, Chief Clark, a very well-respected elder, may be sincere in his wish for the president to extend his term by six months. We wish to categorically restate that the president will step down on May 29. 2023 after serving two terms as per the constitution okay having been the first recipient of a democratic transfer of power from an incubate administration to an opposition candidate in nigeria's history the president is committed to extending and entrenching democratic values across the country he shall in turn have the privilege of serving the people of nigeria to whomever they choose to free fair and credible elections. However, Chief Clark is right to say that without security, Nigeria would not likely realize its true potential as a peaceful and prosperous nation. That is why it has been at the core of this administration. The results are there for all to see. We are not seeing anything. Boko Haram has been forced back from controlling whole swaths of this country internally displaced persons are now returning to rebuild their communities <laughs> okay these achievements have been accomplished through the bravery and determination of the nigerian armed forces and the fortitude of the people of our nation garbasheu said <laughs> but wait wait i want to ask i heard somewhere around that speech that boko haram has been forced back from controlling our country which Boko Haram is Gabashe we talking about? So Boko Haram is not holding siege on Bono State again, Abi. Is Sambisa Forest not in Nigeria again? Has Boko Haram been forced out of our forest already? Shehu Gaba. What are you talking about? 
He has, he said internally displaced persons are now returning to rebuild their communities. Where? How? When? It's funny that as one set of the IDP is returning, more are being displaced to return and rebuild again. This is funny now. My only joy here is that presidency has already declined the request to extend tenure by six months. I thank God for that. Please remember to follow us on all our social media channels showing on your screen right now. Until I see you again, my name is ADS. Signing out.